Hey YouTube, it's your boy at Chicago Sport, man. I got another video, and this is some breaking news. Here we go, NBA season. It's it, it's starting right now. I'm telling you, you know, we got a major trade that just happened, and we've already seen two this off season. You know, it's it's still pretty much the off season, preseason, whatever. Um, but yeah, this uh, Jer uh, James Harden was traded to the Houston Rockets in a multiplayer deal. Okay. Um. He, uh, Kevin Martin was in this trade. Now, now th this is how it all went down. The Thunder had till Wednesday to sign James Harden to a long-term deal because he is uh, going to be a free agent in 2013. So they had to try to get a deal with him, and if they didn't get the deal with him, he was most likely going to be gone next year. So they had the option to use him for this only year and have him be gone, or you know just um, trade him like they did here. Um, Honestly, I was hoping he opt for free agency because it looked like a Bulls were going to try to get a deal in for him. Uh, but uh, whatever, whatever with that. Um, yeah. Uh, but th this this trade this, this trade also had Kevin Martin in the trade, which um, and Jeremy Lamb. Uh, Jeremy Lamb was a first rounder from Connecticut, UConn. Um, so that uh, J Jeremy Lamb looked like a kid that would have a lot of potential, and he's going to go to the Thunder. And he's going to bring his talents to the Thunder. And we'll, we'll see how this all works out. Um, Kevin Martin is also obviously going to look good with the Thunder. Um, James Harden is going to really, really help um, the Rockets. Um, this was the full trade. It was um, the Thunder who sent over James Harden. Uh, there were some other guys. Uh, Cole Adrich and forward Deonke Cook. And Lazar Hayward, bunch of no nobodies. Um, and the Rockets sent over Kevin Martin, Jeremy Lamb, and two first round picks and a second rounder. Now, um, here is the question: Who does this? Which team got the good deal out of this? Because obviously, I think both teams are going to benefit from this trade. Not not like the whole entire Dwight Howard trade, when only the 76ers, the Nuggets. And the Lakers got a good deal from it, and you know we got the got the magic on the side. But this is only a two-team deal, so obviously we're gonna see a, a better uh, trade here. Um, and, and you know with with such a big name, you gotta you gotta you, you have that. Um, so yeah, I'm I'm gonna do the uh, the the lineup that, that that it should be. Um, it looks like it's gonna be Russell Westbrook as point guard, and now right here at shooting guard, I'm not sure. I'm sure I, I'm guessing it'll probably be Kevin Martin who will start in the shooting guard position. For the Thunder, um, instead of Tabo Cephalosha, and you know Cephalosha, he is a great player. He's a, gr a great defensive player. He, uh, you know, we, we saw at times him shutting down big name players like we uh, like Tabo Cephalosha was really able to shut down LeBron James in some uh, critical points in that NBA playoffs, which the Thunder did lose, but still, yeah. So I'm, I'm guessing Kevin Martin's gonna start right there, um, but Tabo Cephalosha will be a great bench guy to bring into your games or to even have that when Ke if Kevin Martin gets hurt um and then Kevin Durant obviously small forward Serge Ibaka and Kendrick Perkins so they they got some really good scores and some really good defenders on that team now um and and, and they did they, they still had that um obviously Kevin Durant can uh work on his defense defensive whatever uh de defense <laughs> And uh, Russell Westbrook could as well. Um, now this is going to be the Houston Rockets um, starting lineup here. Jeremy Lin looks like he is going to start in that point guard position. A uh, very good player. Uh, lots of potential with Jeremy Lin. Um, and obviously James Harden is going to be the new starter in the Houston Rockets. Now um, in Thunder with the Thunder, James Harden was a great bench player. He came off the bench. And he's a starter anyway. He 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 could have been a, he was obviously a starter in, um, you know, uh, the Thunder. Um, but they they went with more of a defensive style with Tabo Cepalosha, you know. And I can get I can get why they did that. And and he was a guy. Yeah, you take him off the bench in the first second quarter, and he sparks up an offense for you with the guys on the bench with Kevin Durant with Russell Westbrook. They they all those three work together very well. You know, and I'm sure he's going to work very well with Jeremy Lin. If Jeremy Lin is able to get an assist higher, if he can get a pass better, uh, James Harden going off rolls, whatever he's going to do, it's going to look great 
for the Thunder. And this Thunder team, they were this close last year to making it to the playoffs with a team that, that, that wasn't that strong, you know. Um, and, and so, yeah, uh, Ch Chandler Parsons at small forward, uh, Patrick Patterson and Omar Ashik. Um, yeah, I think this deal worked out for the Thunder just because what they have on that team. Um, yeah, I, I don't really know too much about Chandler Parsons, Patrick Patterson, or Omar Sheik. Uh, well, I know I know about Omar Sheik. Um, <laughs> Omar Sheik used to play for the Bulls um, last year. Uh, Omar Sheik is a great defensive player. Um, you know he, he's gonna he's gonna do a lot for this defense with the Rockets. Now the Rockets did lose Louis Scola um, this off season, and he he went to Phoenix. Um, but yeah, uh, you know uh, like I said, I don't really know about Patrick Patterson that much, or I don't really know too much about Chandler Parsons. Um, but still, I think this team's going to look really good, and they could definitely make it to the playoffs. Now, I'm not saying they will. It really just depends on how Jeremy Lin's going to turn out for this team. If Jeremy Lin does not turn out good, and this team just totally sucks with Jeremy Lin, because Jeremy Lin is going to be able to do anything, Jeremy Lin is still a big question mark, especially coming off of an injury. He is a question mark. Um, you know, uh... Obviously, I, I'm pretty sure is that James Harden's going to do great unless something horrific happens, you know, that, that no one would have ever seen. Because um, he, he's a he's a great player. Um, he won six-man last year. Um, you know, and, and, you know, Kevin Martin in the Thunder, I think that's also going to help him out a lot. Um, you know, you still are very strong in the shooting guard position. Um, you might even be a little bit stronger. You know, you, I'm sure losing James Harden is bad, but, um, Kevin, Kevin Martin has, has showed how good he is in the past, and I'm, I'm sure he's going to show it with the, the Thunder as well, and he's going to work really well with Russell Westbrook and, um, Kevin Durant, um, he's going to, you know, um, and I'm sure, uh, the Oklahoma City uh, Thunder is definitely going to be a playoff team, no doubt about it, most, um, I'm sure they're going to have a big test with the, um, with the Lakers, but here's another question. Why mess with greatness for the Thunder? This team was great. But I think their move was, we got to beat the Lakers. That's what I think their move was. Because with the Lakers looking as good as they do right now, they I'm pretty sure they had to make a, a deal. And, you know, sometimes with this whole entire contract thing, especially since the Thunder wanted to give him a max, max deal with James Harden, and it didn't go through because, you know, James Harden didn't want to accept it. They don't want to get the locker room stirred up. And another thing, the Thunder didn't want to get the locker room, uh, not the Thunder, the Rockets did not want to get the, get the um, locker room, um, you know, all, all screwed up either. Because it looked like Kevin Martin was going to get traded sometime in this season. It was almost a done deal. Kevin Martin's going to be gone from Rockets. So that's obviously not surprising. Right when this trade happened, nobody knew who, who was going to go. It, all we knew is that James Harden was gone. First thing I said. Kevin Martin's going to go to the Thunder. I, 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 I knew this. I'm sure a lot of people predicted this. Um, but, yeah. Uh, you, you don't want to get the, the locker room all, all messed up, especially with how great these teams are. Um, all the potential with the Thunder. And the Thunder really do look like a Oklahoma City Thunder team. I mean, the Rockets really look like an Oklahoma City Thunder team, uh, you know, three, four years ago when they first got Kevin Durant. This team... They were they, they didn't pan out right away, you know. They they didn't. Um, and there was lots of question marks in this team. All he knew was that Kevin Durant was a hell of a player. Okay, and maybe Jeremy Lin is that question mark with the Rockets. You never know. Um, I I actually do like Jeremy Lin. I don't think he's a bad player. Um, I think he will help out the Rockets. Um, I think I think the Rockets are going to be a very good team, especially now with James Harden. Um, it's it's going to look really cool. Um, when the regular season when we see James Harden play in that Rockets uniform. It's going to look really cool. Um, you know, so, yeah, this is this is a big deal. I uh, made a long video about this. Uh, yeah, uh, you know, th this video, um, if you guys see this, uh, please subscribe to me. Please comment, like, and ask me uh, questions in the comment box. Tell me what you think, whatever. Um, I want you all to peace out. Um, yeah, so, uh, also got a Twitter, so follow me on that.